What's good, everybody? It's and we're back here with another review, and this time it's of Ash Williams Custom 1-6 scale piece from Beetle Metalli from Evil Dead 2. Now, this piece right here is pure bananas, guys. I'm telling you, this is this is really, really something. Something special. Um, little backstory to how I acquired the piece. My good boy, Dr. Satan, out on Instagram. Uh, shout out to him. Um, his real name is Ash, funny to say. Uh, just like the character here. I knew he had this piece, and I had to approach him. And uh, I had to bargain with him a little bit because I know he was so attached to the piece, but he finally let, let it go when I traded him Big Ben and Acropsy. And you guys should follow him for more pictures of Big Ben and Acropsy. He's doing those pieces justice by Once Customs. And he's happy. I'm happy. I mean, this piece is amazing. There was a V1 version of this piece done by Beetle Metalli. And it, it was good, but it didn't compare to what he pulled off here. Now, let's go with the head skull. He's got those real glossy eyes, the nice blood work, the sculpted hair, the skin tone, the cut off hand that he had in the movie, where he had to cut off his own hand and replace it with the chainsaw, which this chainsaw is nothing but pure, pure art. It even has a string right here where it would go into his uh, a little holster there where he would pull it to turn it on. We have the accurate straps, little nipple action going on over there, yes. We have some blood over here, like when he was scratched in the movie. Uh, leather belt, some actual corduroy pants, which are really damn near impossible uh, to find in this hobby. So the fact that um, Beetle pulled it off, or sure to say Lupita, who was the tailor. Uh, it's good, man. Sculpted boots. The dagger. Sculpted hands. Nicely weathered. Like Beetle, uh, Beetle, we all know Beetle does light weathering, but in this case, I think he did just the right amount of weathering and did the uh, movie justice, the character justice. The shotgun there is, <laughs> I'm not going to pull it out, but um, real wood. It opens up uh, at the barrel where you load it, and uh, I've heard it's real metal. Uh, I don't know if it's sculpted or real metal. I can't tell the difference, so I'm not going to really comment on it, but it's it's fire. Let's look at the COA. Evil Dead 2, Ash Williams, 1-6 custom figure. Limited edition, 14 of 30 pieces. We have... The exclusive, which came with this diorama, which I believe was done by Vito's cousin, or I, I forget who... But this is the diorama, diorama in the cabin where Henrietta, which is this nice little exclusive that came with the dial. She was uh, kept in there in the little, uh, in little entranceway to the basement. We have the middle finger hand, which is the variant of this hand. And we have the Necronomicons. We have a resin one, which is all the way to the left here. We have one with the articul uh, like the mouth with the eyes popping out and all that when the Necronomicon was actually moving. And then we have one made of, I believe it's some sort of rubber and because like, this is a real book guys. It opens up and all that. It's got a bunch of pages, it's crazy. And so the people that, you know, wear gloves during their uh, reviews and to the people that, oh, you shouldn't touch these figure with gloves, man. I, I don't give a fuck. This is my figure. It's staying with me. I'm going to do with it what I want. It'll be just fine. It ain't leaving. But the diorama's sick. The Henriette extra sculpt is amazing. The paint application is really, really good. I have to say. So, all in all, this piece is a must-have. I believe to be one of Beto's favorite releases that he's done. Actually, I have the box over here. Sorry. Evil Dead 2, Dead by Dawn. That's the front cover, Kiss Your Nerves Goodbye. And it has a side and all that, but it's kind of lined up with my Beto stuff, so I'm just gonna leave that there. But this is a perspective shot of the piece, and yeah, man, this was definitely a home run. I gotta give a shout out to Dr. Satan. Follow him on Instagram, D O C T O R dot S A T A N, if y'all didn't know how to spell. 
on Instagram. Uh, real good dude. Always posts cool shit. And thanks, Ash, for trading this. Uh, this piece is definitely going to stay in the collection forever. But until next time, y'all, stay sick, stay evil, but don't be dead. Two. Peace.